I feel like you asked for Daryl Griffith a while ago and I just messed up and never made that video. For those who don't know Daryl Griffith, aka Dr. Duncanstein, aka the Golden Griffith, he was like Donovan Mitchell before Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell even did a tribute dunk to him in the slam dunk contest. Daryl was the number two pick in the 80 draft, and basically his first five seasons, he's a 20 points per game guy. Just explosive athlete, really quick, really fast twitch muscles, but also led the league in three point percentage at one point in his career. It's 80s three point shooting, so it's like 36.9% or something. Um, not that high volume, but for the age, great three point shooter. There's the Griffith Danley era that never has that much success. They're around 500, a little over, I think 45 wins is where they peak out at. Um, Danley gets traded away, Carl Malone comes in through the draft, uh, and that team probably could have been a really good team, but Griffith ends up, I think it's a stress fracture in his foot that takes him out. He misses an entire season, and just like the immediate drop off pre and post that injury are stunning to see. And I mean, stunning, but also kind of expected because it's a foot injury and he is an athletic player that runs and jumps and dunks. Really hard to do that when you don't have a foot. But yeah, great player, five seasons averaging 20 plus. Uh, really a shame that he never even got an all-star nod. Would have been a nice thing to have on the resume.